Check it. Oh, yeah. oh. Check it. I got the camper all set up okay. in the campgrounds. Plenty of room for a big old trailer. Maybe two cars. Oh, what? The river. Oh, watch out, dog. So, there's another campsite right there, but it's for handicapped folks. And then they got this. They got this dock over here for you to fish off of. Right here off the path. Uh, where is it? Yeah. A walking path. Pretty slick, man. And yeah, there's camp again. Fire pit. Over there, they got a sand pit for the kids. They got ho horseshoe rings, horseshoe pits. And then there's a outhouse over there as well. This place is it's five bucks a night per car. Maximum of 14 days. And then here's the view. So that right there, that's an island behind us. Behind me, anyways. Last time I was here, this dude was catching like two foot long carp out of this calm area right do, 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 do. here yeah it's pretty calm come out here on the deck A little area for the kids to play the dogs to play Super chill, man. And check it. So it's just us, and then the camp post. That's it. So don't tell anybody about this place. Let me flip the camera around. Maybe. Do 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 do. No, not gonna, not gonna happen. But yeah. So these mountains back here. These ones back here. This is where I used to go uh, cougar hunting. It was back in this area. And then just on the other side of that mountain, I used to go turkey hunting. And then just around that mountain, I uh, had breakfast with, there had to have been like 40 deer in this herd, man. It was huge. I had breakfast with them. They came up right next to me. It was like 10 feet away. Super chill. Oh, yeah, so there's the, there's the restroom in reference to our camp. This place is awesome. Normally there's like bald eagles that hang out, out here on this island. And you can see the fish jumping out of the river. This place is the shit. show you the campground a little bit our camp site anyways a little area for a tent here not a little area it's actually substantially large there's Tiffy and Noah and the dogs so the dogs do they got to be leashed while you're here that's one of the downsides they do have to be leashed but I think for what you get for five bucks a night it's, uh, it's worth it take you over here show you check that guy out see him Olin yeah so Comes with picnic benches, all the sites have picnic benches. There's the sand pit for the babies. 
And then there's the horseshoe pit. I don't know if they've got horseshoes out here or if you have to bring your own. Let me check. I'm thinking you got to bring your own. Yeah, looks like you got to bring your own. And then I'll show you the sign. That way you can read it, all the rules and all that. Looks like they got a little bit of a gopher problem here. So, I don't know if you can... Oh, it's backwards. You're not going to be able to read that. But well, basically, 12 people per site. Two-week limit. Fire in the fire rings only. Five bucks a night. And then you got to fill out your envelope fee. It's kind of based on the honor system here. And then just put it in the drop box. But there's more, more campsites around. Oh, I guess I lied. I'm not the only one here. I, <clears throat> looks like there's the camp post and two other trailers out of ten spots. So, not bad for a Friday afternoon. Let's see here. I don't know how clean the facilities are here. No showers. I'm not going to go in the girls to show how that works, but yeah, it's pretty clean in here. Pretty clean. Doesn't stink. So if you wanted to go fishing here, you are going to need an Idaho license. And for a non-resident weekend pass, it's like 40 bucks or something, man. It's pretty expensive per person. Or per license or whatever. But that's everything. Hope you enjoyed it. Talk to you later.